And thanks, Megan. A major Fox News, News alert. Explosive new details about the FBI investigations into the Clinton Foundation and Hillary Clinton's private email server that could now dramatically alter the outcome of the election, which is only six days away. As Brett Baer reported earlier tonight, sources are now telling Fox News that the FBI is actively and aggressively pursuing a case involving allegations of pay to play at the Clinton Family Foundation. Now, the sources say the probe into the foundation is now, quote, very high in terms of its priority, and there is, quote, an avalanche of new information coming in every day. Agents also indicate that multiple people are being interviewed, and some are even being re-interviewed about this case. Now, the sources also revealed to Brett Baer stunning new information about Hillary Clinton's private email server, saying authorities now believe there is a 99% chance that up to five five foreign intelligence agencies may have accessed this server and taken these emails. Here now with the very latest details on all of this, Fox News Chief Intelligence Correspondent Catherine Herridge. I don't know where to start. Five intelligence agencies. Would we elect a president that potentially could be blackmailed? Well, Sean, what we know tonight is that there is new evidence that the FBI's investigation of the Clinton Foundation is not dead. FBI agents are quietly working the Clinton Foundation case out of four offices across the country, including Southern California, Arkansas, Washington, D.C., and New York City. And multiple sources say the Justice Department has been tapping the brakes on this investigation by blocking access to a grand jury. As part of its ongoing investigation, Fox News was first to report in January that the FBI email probe had expanded to look at whether the intersection of Clinton Foundation work and State Department business under Secretary Clinton may have violated public corruption laws. While the State Department emails and WikiLeaks now show evidence of coordination, in January Hillary Clinton tried to dismiss the reporting of Fox News as rumor. Is that story true? Absolutely not. It's an unsourced, irresponsible uh, you know, claim that has no basis, and it is something that uh, you know, really is um, without merit and should not have any uh, influence whatsoever in this uh, nominating process. What we also know tonight is that computers belonging to Clinton's personal attorney, attorney Cheryl Mills, there on the left, and aide Heather Samuelson were not destroyed as part of an immunity deal with the Justice Department in the email case. Both lawyers are central to the investigation because they decided which Clinton emails were government work, deleting the rest, and those computers are now in evidence and still available to Clinton Foundation investigators. And while the review of Anthony Weiner's computer is not complete, Fox News is told tonight that there does appear to be a lot of new stuff and a strong belief among agents that classified material is in play. Sean? All right, Catherine Herridge, thank you all.